Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrincetonTrader.com, here for NTMarkets.com with your Thursday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, daily chart of the ES. We had a push-up last night on the uh, on the news out of China. I would expect to revisit that area today to give that 89.90 area a test and see if the bulls uh, can push through. Um, that would probably be, be, you know, if not off the open, fairly early off the open. Then um, we'll have to see what the bears have. If it can roll from there, then um, you know we'll see if the if the bears can push things back to the middle band, and this continues to be kind of a of a two-sided range-bound grind up. I'm not ruling out a test of the highs. I came out fairly bearish yesterday, and I stand by that as an intermediate theory. I think that we're going to see lower levels uh, before we see massive runs up to new highs. I've been wrong before. I could be wrong again, but for now, that's how I'm setting it up. We're trading the long side and the short side, um, but our intermediate view is that it is more likely that we have a move lower, that this that this that this compression in the Bollinger Bands resolves down eventually um, than than up. So, you know. Moments like this, you know, you see it peaking higher and you think to yourself, well, maybe we are going to go on an upper band ride. And maybe we do. And if you do, I mean, you just adjust. But uh, for now, uh, we still continue to see an inability by the bulls to hold highs. So the real test is 92 half and then 98 half. But I, I, I said this last week. I don't know if it was on the subscriber or on this webcast. I'm much more concerned with um, with 92 half than I am with 98 half. I think if 92 half goes, 98 half will come pretty quickly. But it's been that 92, 93 area that the bulls have struggled with immensely. And they didn't get through it last night. We may get a chance to see it today and see how it reacts. We'll have to see what happens. And when I say get through it, they have to close above it. They can't play around. I mean, we can go touch the upper band there at 94.70. If we come back down, and close below 92 half. 92 half isn't converted. It's not converted at all. It's proving to it's proving to us still that it is a problem for the bulls. So my eyes are on 92 half today. We'll see how it goes. Okay, um, everybody have a fantastic day. Follow us on Twitter at Princeton Trader. Check out the website. Come check out the chat room. Uh, market opens in 15 minutes. Have a good one. I will be back tomorrow morning with another webcast. Trade them well, everybody.